Well... I will just be back to start otherwise, but you know... This might actually work in Daisy's favor. Though I'm not quite sure how. <sighs> yep. Wonder just about when uh, this episode or this Let's Play in general will be uploaded. Like I said, probably for the holiday season. The month of December. Where most people will uh, hopefully have a time to just sit back and relax. And oh, okay. That won't be quite as eventful, seeing that uh, we are not that far off from each other. But you really gotta wonder, for all the years uh, train services have been functional... Sometimes you gotta wonder if they are even aware of that they live in... That they are doing business uh, or <laughs> operating in uh, such... In certain countries. Countries where snow are abound during winter and such. I mean, I kind of get delays during rush hour, that's pretty much to be expected. But for weather conditions, it's like, come on. Because, yeah, sometimes a ridiculous amount of snow will fall during the day. But during the night, when the services are not. Uh, when the trains are not in service uh, for the most part. Uh, can't they just spend time getting rid of this whole. S of all the snow? I mean, come on, please. We are paying for the service after all, and we expect this. Yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna complain too much, I suppose, because in a way, it is kind of like karma. Complain too much about uh, businesses not uh, work as one might expect, and then you find yourself working for a business, you know, having a job yourself, and then people will start yelling at you for stuff you might not be in control of. Now the question is... Uh, nope, he does not have anything. <laughs> Will we get to see what... Okay then! And I still have some coins, damn it! Well maybe we are to expect Bowser Space's lot on this space, huh? <laughs> Board, I mean, sorry. From just me this time! <laughs> Fine, see if I care. It's basically a red space. Parasailing, perhaps? Dungeon duels! I don't think I got much interest to say, actually, honestly. Right about now. I might have been just uh, commentary out during this uh, Let's Play. Ah. Uh, Maybe that's why you are not uh, supposed to be in quite a rush when you do a let's play. Perhaps come back to a new session once you actually have stuff to talk about, you know. Like we just... Well, perhaps uh, something like this. A couple of my colleagues uh, were kind of discussing preferences in, well, women. One preferred... Uh, the beautiful and silent ones, uh, while the other one had to prioritize uh, personality. And well, the one preferring personality overall said he had such a bore with his last date. But uh, when he showed uh, the image of the girl to the one preferring well looks and silence, uh, well, he said, "Well, why don't I take her? Take her instead." <laughs> If you think she's boring, then I'll be happy to oblige uh, with- uh oh I swear I pushed A. Oh man, is it going to be that kind of thing right now? Ah, boy. 
But me, I uh, unfortunately, I am a bit more pi I am more picky than those two. For me, both looks and personality needs to be in place. So just because those two got... Uh... Okay, it has to be the middle one. It can't be... Really? It's the same one? Okay, let's see them. No, it was different that time. Ah, uh, we have lost this one. <laughs> All because of one blunder. <laughs> Yeah, absolutely no way. Why even bother? Yeah, I lost. Of course, different men prefer different looks. Uh, but in general, I think men uh, need to find a girl cute or pretty first. Before they can even consider going on a date with them and see if their personality matches that of a, of a long and uh, long-term and committed relationship or if uh, if it's just for short time to have you know fun for a short while and then decide to move on depends on what uh, people are comfortable with of course but you really gotta make sure you are both on the same term in that regard that you both know you'll be walking away after one night or two. And if you then all of a sudden start to, start to develop... Uh, despite the textbook right there, the, the baby monster looked... Sounded kind of sad actually, but like, oh, come on, you don't have any... <clears throat> I'm, I'm sorry. I was like, oh, I can't give it to Star now, you don't have enough coins. Kind of like that. But yeah, it is possible to develop feelings uh, after parting ways um, from a short-term uh, relationship or, or a one-night stand. <laughs> and it's not, it's not really anyone's fault, I don't think. But uh, you can't really get obsessed uh, either, if you know what I'm saying. Do I even... What did that one do, actually? Let's see. Can I roll uh, higher than six? Well, let's find out. If I can get a five on my first roll... Really? The worst possible roll, as some might put it. <laughs> Didn't even get the happening space. Well, that was useless. But not that one. Ah, Spitfire Barrel, you get her two times the normal amount of coins. Ack! Let the rotten minigame begin already. Paratrooper Plunge, Paratrooper Plunge! Oh, come on. Will be freaking awesome, but. Once again, I suppose beggars cannot be choosers. Especially considering I don't see myself winning this one. Stop. Let's try to get a head start this time. And just then just keep a steady pace. See if that strategy works. Okay, going a bit too fast now. Yeah, because I think you recover stamina a lot slower than you actually use it. Even if you stop up completely, I mean. Not that I would like to test that right about now, but... Uh... Oh crap, Daisy is catching up. And she has a lot of stamina, stamina to expend. But she might not be smart enough to... Uh, Give it the last burst for the final stretch and just keep a steady pace. Okay, I won actually. Huh. So I guess that is the strategy, at least against the AI. <laughs> I 
But yeah, so we are actually all uh, quite a ways away from Bowser now. <laughs> so it is very possible we will go through the entire game with nobody reaching him. Then again, I think we have to pass, pass by him if we want that star. Does he eventually swap spaces? Uh, I don't know. Warp pipe is definitely useful on this board. Though it should be obvious that it is useful on any board, really. It actually got buffed from the warp block from Mario Party 3 because uh, in Mario Party 3 it was random. It was random which player you would swap places with, but this time you actually get to choose if you are uh, if you can handle the roulette properly. Me, huh? <laughs> It's a race, I guess. Now, Luigi, perhaps you will be so kind. Ah! I really, I don't get it. I don't get it. He was on his way, and I, what the? Okay, to be fair, Daisy is considered to be Luigi's love interest. So I guess it all worked out in the end, in that sense. Oh man, but not for this time, because I got her on my- Okay then! Another one! Sure, why not? Huh. <sighs> Once again, two times in a row, man. Two times in a row, man. God damn it! <laughs> okay. For once, uh, let's shut the hell up and pay attention. Okay. Now I have a fair idea on what path I need to take. So yeah, if you if you push a C button actually, you can look at the map, but no. Which button was it? Have I not have I not mapped the, the Z button on this thing? That can't be right. Oh it's the Y button, sorry. Alright, so all I can do now is hope that Daisy gets uh, to the treasure. Well, that was easy. <laughs> See, kids, uh, it is kind of difficult to fail as long as you pay attention in class. <laughs> but the sad truth of the matter is, uh, not everyone is interested in the topic at hand or a subject being taught, uh, and as such, uh, they don't really want to pay attention. It ain't a perfect, it ain't a perfect world regardless, uh, but uh, think of the scenario in which uh, Somebody is not interested in anything at school. Sounds kind of hopeless, actually. So yeah, if, when you turn mini, you are forced uh, to not be able to use any items. Either. Oh man, Vario could get uh, the, the first and perhaps only happening space in this game. Sure did. Blue fire too. Yeah, so what that does, if you have any mush mushrooms in your inventory, one of them will get burnt. Now Luigi could... Now of course not. He's not being stupid. When is Luigi ever stupid? Oh yeah, I'm sorry I was born with that kind of uh, plumber for a brother. Uh, I would have liked the launch space, oh well. <laughs> Four player mini game. New one, new one, new one, new one. No. Same old, same old. 
Going for a swim. A fresh change of pace. Considering the current board we are at. Get to cool down a bit. So here is an interesting trivia. If any of you have played Twilight Princess. If you talk to Midna at certain points inside of a dungeon or places in general, she might actually say something different. Like inside inside of the Goron Mines, when you reach the first room in which you will find water, and if you talk to Midna then, she will actually say, huh, how refreshing or something like that. Something different, something different from what she usually says. So yeah, I kind of consider it an easter egg of sorts in that regard. <laughs> kind of like the Met Metal Gear Codex. <laughs> like you stop up for a moment to just talk and see if they say anything different. Which they kind of do every time in Metal Gear games, at the very least the newer ones I think. 32. Daisy got no crotch, I don't think. She is only legs. Ideal? <laughs> hmm. Last five turns already. Well, this has been a boring game, actually. So, just so you know, Baby Bowser, your party sucks! This dinosaur has standards. Victim. <laughs> Are we going to victim blame or something? How appropriate? How appropriate? Why, thank you! I may have to skip out, or, out on the shop, uh, but this is actually what I wanted. If I had to choose, I mean. <sighs> but of course, uh, you would like both, if possible. Both? 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 Both is good. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that Bowser mini game right there, it might actually be a bad one. I don't, I don't remember quite what it does, but it might actually take items from your inventory. And then you have to choose which item you get to keep. And the other ones, uh, maybe Bowser takes. So I'm not sure why I wanted to go for that uh, previously, but I guess I had to find out. Nice roll! <laughs> now let's get out of here for once. Come on. Not a high roller this game, I feel. Did not even get one of the mushrooms. Hello, Wario. Goodbye, Wario. <coughs> Uh, the fat man is the goalie. <clears throat> Wario has been waiting for this moment. The prize money is mine. He will move on to the Champions League. But look at those legs, though. <laughs> yeah, even, even the Super Smash Brothers. Uh, his kick attack is kind of puny. <laughs> My god! <laughs> You're kidding me right now! Vario! You can't- okay, that was just me missing. Okay, one! <laughs> I was about to say. <laughs> Do 
don't underestimate them. They make cartoons and short stories about stuff like this, you know. The fat man may be small, but as a goalie or as... As a defender in general. Don't, don't underestimate them. Weight matters. And size matters. They really do. Especially in boxing, because... Uh, And if the size matters, uh, the size matches and the weight matches, uh, your wallet gets even fatter and bigger. Makes sense, I guess. But yeah, even in boxing, you know, once you're a heavyweight, uh, <clears throat> once you are a heavyweight, uh, you just need to get as uh, big as you can. Because at that point, uh, there is no limit as far as I'm concerned. So if if we f if we truly go by that rule, if there existed giants, they will be practically be allowed to box against the reg regular humans or people who are considered the regular heavy heavyweights. <laughs> but yeah, this is um this has been a really uninteresting game for this board. Kind of disappointing, actually. With Bowser being around a little bit, but or maybe it's just because he was placed so far away so early. <laughs> Slime power. Hmm. Who needs uh, fossil fuels when we got slime? In more sense than in more senses than one, I mean. <laughs> So while this minigame tests uh, your um, button mashing speed, I guess it also tests your stamina. Which doesn't make it all that different from domination, huh? does it? <laughs> 